let's get creative and take a look at what's in this week's box. Beautiful delicate spring box. Let's take a closer look. Chrysanthemums, tulips, fairy ostomon, and the amazing blossom. Anything that has a really woody stem is always a great idea to cut up the stem just to open the surface area so that it can drink more. And just position the blossom to one side. Next we're going to work with the area ostomon. Now this foliage is actually in the next coming days. You're going to watch it and it's going to flower. Each of these little flowers are going to pop open and up the stems. We're going to condition the flowers by giving them a quick snip and then into the vase they go with the blossom. Next we're going to work with the chrysanthemums. These flowers are all going to open up the stem so you need to pay attention to where you position them in the arrangement. Reduce the stem height or the stem length a little bit by just giving them a cut. And you can also remove some of the lower flowers for this particular design just to allow a bit more room but we'll put these in as well a bit later. And then you want to just give them a little bit of a wiggle and in they go. Next we're going to work with the beautiful tulips. Give them a little trim. If there's a leaf like this, just pull it down to remove. That way when you put it amongst the other flowers, it'll fit really nicely. You want to make sure that you give the tulips some extra room to grow because they will um, continue to grow towards the light during the week as they open. With the little short crazy buds that you cut off earlier, what you want to do is just cluster them into little groups of three, remove any little bits of foliage, give them a quick snip and just nestle them amongst the neck of the vase, just like that, making sure that the water is nice and high. And there you have it, that's this week's blooms. <laughs>